these guys spent two years in Antarctica and I spent about eight hours in a voiceover booth, but I think our contributions are, are equal, right, to the final product. Um, I mean, we both put a lot of work into it, so. <laughs> they were in Antarctica and the, vo and the voiceover booth I was in was very air conditioned, like maybe even overly air conditioned. So I get it, that's what I'm trying to say, yeah. Well, penguins are so incredible. They're such expressive little creatures and, uh, and they have such an incredible physicality. It, it, after watching them for a while, you just, as an actor, you want to get in their heads and you want to kind of understand how they think. And it just was so, it was so fun to, to spend all this time kind of watching and learning about the penguins and then kind of bringing Steve, the main penguin, to life. So, yeah. Yeah, it's really a mixture of, uh, you know, s scripted formal narration. And then there are parts where uh, where I slip into kind of Steve's inner monologue. And that was, some of that was scripted, some of that we we played around with all of it, right? We, we tried to find the right, the best energy, the best line. We tried lots of different versions of things. And then I think in the final edit, they just built, built with what they had. I think people are going to feel a lot of awe about the just tenacity and scrappiness of these little penguins that seem so adorable and cute, but they are tough. And also a lot of, uh, I hope, a lot of awe and inspiration about the, the beauty and uh, fragility of our planet and, uh, and the incredible wildlife and how interconnected everything is.